Good day, good way. This is Tony. Um, here in Reveal T Jinx. Um, just working on a manifestation grid. Um, just sitting here thinking, okay, hey, I've been out on the waters in a while. So wanna apply some gemstone energy and a little manipulation, magic, whatever you want to call it. Uh, kind of time for a cruise. So one of the things you could do when you're making crystal grids is you could um, kind of use them in the sense of wish magic. Like I'm wishing I'm getting back out on the water. So I'm taking something that's um, already related to where I want to go. I wouldn't mind getting back out on a carnival cruise. This is an old cruise car. So now you can take that and I'm putting, this is an Organite with a Laramar that I used um, from one of the times I went out on a cruise during a hurricane. So I'm putting that protection piece on there. You can add other items, like that's a um, Chinese luck coin. So I'm trying to bring some fortune in towards getting to a cruise, but I also want to bring in that protection. If I wanted to, I could add a bunch of chakra stones, and this is like three or four sets of chakra stones in a bag that I keep. Um, notice I'm keeping with this theme of blue. From there, you can add your gemstones. Uh, in this case, I have a Laramar necklace that I got from um, St. Thomas on a cruise before. So you can kind of like blend that energy in there. And you know, with, with grids, um, it's, you know, cool to have them all fancy and organized and all that good stuff, but it's the intentions that you want to make sure that are solid. Performance, I mean, um, appearance and aesthetics, cool. Performance and intentions, great. Better have those in alignment. So, all right. From there, you can kind of like go through what you got going on and just follow your int intuition. Okay, so I'm trying to manifest this grid. So let's see what I can get going here. And bear with me, I'll try to switch hands a little bit. I'm going to try and bring this in. Um, notice I'm trying to face the stones kind of like in the same direction. Sticking with my blues. These are actually aqua obsidians. Now I could go grab more shells because I got a bunch of shells. But I'm in the middle of making this, so I'm going to go with what I got. Remember, I'm trying to manifest this energy. So basically what I'm doing is just um, lining these gemstones in accordance with their directions. But um, if you notice, I'm kind of like spiraling the energy. And I'm spiraling in the sense where I'm trying to bring in what I want. And what I want is not only the cruise, but of course the funds to pay for the cruise. So in a sense, this is a manifestation grid, but it does have some prosperity elements tied into it because, of course, in order to go on the cruise, you're going to need to fund the cruise. So basically what I'm getting at here is that if you have something that you're wishing for, something that you're trying to work on, you can put that as the basis and you can put your other items on top of it. All this in this sense will serve as a, um, a master crystal of some sort. This is the, the main focus on the energy. So this is the focus. And from here, my desire to manifest another cruise is going to transpire out through all these stones. When you're connecting a grid in this fashion, it is just as simple as taking your finger and starting from your starting point. And if you want to get fancy, catch everything around the starting point, loop it back in, and then follow the trail until you get it to manifest out. And then once you get there, then boom. You can consciously um, intent the grid to be active. I want this grid to be flowing in a clockwise fashion to the point to where it is now manifesting the energies but not only the energies of um, abundance as in the sense of finances but also the protective energies to make it a safe cruise 
we, this is the hurricane season, so I don't want to necessarily get a, the funds or win a cruise or Carnival call me with a free cruise, and I've had that happen before. I don't want them to call me with a free cruise and say, hey, you got to go next week. And then I get out there and we got another one of these, you know, hurricanes. So you got to think of the bigger picture. I want a cruise. I want the fortune to get it, but I also want the protection of it. And I want to bring in all these other elements to try and get it flowing. So just something short and simple. This could have been a healing spell. This could have been anything. But for me personally, I'm kind of ready to get back on the water. So I use the cruise. Hope this makes sense. Peace and wholeness.